Well, while I'm flying, I notice, uh, uh, what kind of wizard is this? Well, doesn't matter, it's gonna die. <laughs> um, I got a, actually, I do need a blizzard rod, or is it an ice rod? I don't remember. Um, one of the freezing rod, um, no. Actually, does blizzard rod count? You know what, I'm gonna take that to the case. <laughs> Sorry, abrupt, um, abrupt intro, but hey guys, this is, uh, Chibi Skevin, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Um, yeah, I was on my way to get a Korok, but, eh. Shoot, there's some stuff here. Oh god! Eee, eee, hello, hello. Yeah, um, in the last part, um, we got a little bit of trouble with... Can you stop? We got a little bit of a trouble with, <laughs> really, with the Heber region, but... We're all good now, we got fairies, we got a little... Ow, spare Koroks along the way. Okay, that guy's coming this way. We gotta avoid him. Uh, yeah, I was gonna head for a Korok that I said I was gonna head to in the last episode, but along the way I did meet um, a little blizz, a blizz robe. I don't even know what the name of them are, because I will kill them because I hate wizard robes. But whatever. Also, might as well get some Bokoblin guns ahead of time, because I'm probably gonna need them just for upgrading, so yeah. Hello, buddy, how's it going? No! Don't grab that, it's not yours. Get out of here. Ow. Oh wait, gotcha, ha ha, got your weapon, ha 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 ha. Alright, um, yeah, but since we do have, I, I don't know if the blizzard rod even works. I mean, I'm on my head to the core board just to get that quest out of the way, which I do have a picture of the bloopy, by the way, because we do need that. Um, yeah, I might as well try to see if the cork will take it. But we'll see. I'll do that a little bit later. Not right now, just later on. Hey, not you. I kind of want that weapon, but unfortunately I can't because I don't have a lot of items in my inventory. Actually, yeah, I'll take that. <laughs> it's more powerful. And yeah, you can't catch the weapon when you throw them like that, but eh, I'm not going to bother. Gale. Thank you, Rivali. You're gonna keep hearing that pretty much in every episode because I keep constantly using your powers, but it is dang useful. Alright, um, yeah, before I do, I am going to... Oh, that's so cute. They were lying down. Aw, that was cute. Um, yeah, we're gonna head over here because it's right next to the shrine that we got before, but might as well get it. Um, let's see. It's right down here somewhere. I think it's... Oh. Hello, General. I wish I can get you, but you're kind of far off. So I can't really get you. Alright, um... Question is... Is it, like, on top of the... I think it's on top of the pinwheel. Or the... The... The, 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 the windmill things. Gosh, I can't even think of the name for them. I would like to get the enemy forces over there just to get more, you know, materials from them, but... Eh. Uh, I'm not gonna do it right now. Alright, uh, Link, you are running out of stamina. You gotta be careful there, buddy. Climb, climb. Alright, we got the Korok there. I, I believe it's up here from the looks of it. It just looks like it is, so... Uh, oh, no! God, no! Okay, climb! No, climb! Link! Link! Why did you do that? Well, actually, I can make it back up, but still... I wouldn't mean to do that, but try and get as close as possible to the edge, so that way I can use Revali's Gale, but... Alright, um, I believe it's up... Well, actually, I can fly to that. I don't need to use Revali's Gale. I don't need to waste that. Oh, yep, it's right here. I see it. Nope, nope, nope. I need to examine. Examine. There we go. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Alright, um, alrighty, so we got that one. Um, you know what, I might as well head to Korra Forest just to see if it will count, so you know what guys, I'll be right back and we'll be head to Korra Forest. And since we're in the Korra Forest, I might as well try to upgrade something. Maybe weapons or maybe a bow, probably, because I've been kind of lacking on the bow. But before I do, um, I do want to talk to you. You want the bloopy. Oh, Mr. Hero, did you bring it for me? I sure did. Wow, it's even more beautiful than Peaks imagined. 
Thanks so much, Mr. Hero. Now I'm content. Oh, and here's a little thing you get. Peace didn't forget. Yeah, he gives us 100 rupees. Not too bad, buddy. Well, yeah, Mr. Hero needs rupees sometimes, right? Oh, I definitely do need them. If you definitely need rupees, you should shoot an arrow at Bloopy. Yeah, I kind of figured that. Here they drop lots of rupees to pay them. All right, so we got that quest out of the way. Um, there's one more Korok. You actually, does that count? Actually, the Blizzard Rod. Well, look, you got located an Ice Rod, but you're going to have to equip it to impress. Oh, I need to equip it. Oh, it does count. So you don't need an Ice Rod, either a Blizzard Rod or an Ice Rod. That's actually pretty neat. Is that a Blizzard Rod? Incredible Shimmer, unbelievable Sparkle. Thank you, Mr. Hero. The weapon is so amazingly, wonderfully sparkly. I must give you something as thanks. Oh god, man, you guys are rolling in money, sheesh. <laughs> well, thank you guys. Wow, that was actually worth it. Alright, so we got those quests done. Not too bad. Alright, and before we leave, um, let's talk to Hetsu and see if we can upgrade anything. Uh, what about the left stitch? How many do I need? 45? I just have enough. Um, I can't really upgrade for bows. Uh, yeah, let's upgrade weapons. Weapons are more important. Alright. Alright, expand weapon stash, and we have two more slots left. Alright, so unfortunately I can't do anything now, so yeah. Alright, alright, um, I guess I'll head back to the Hebra Tower and we'll do more exploration, so see you guys in a bit. Alright, and it's sunny once again. Like, seriously, it's always sunny whenever I come to this area. But, um, yeah, I guess we're just gonna go, I guess, core hunting in the way. And also there's a shrine nearby, but I, I don't really feel like taking on this shrine, really, honestly. Plus there's plenty of shrines in this area, to be honest. Also, let's get Wolf Link out here. Uh, can't be used again today, what? Hey, what are you talking about, game? He didn't even die, did he? I can't? Really? Huh. Maybe I scanned him too many times today. Huh, that's really weird. I could have sworn he has unlimited um, scanning as long as he doesn't die. That's really strange. Well, I guess I won't have a child companion then. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I see the Korok right over here. Well, I guess I might as well get the shrine out of the way. We haven't done the shrine yet, so I might as well do so. Um, can I? Oh, I, pfft, oh, I can carry this. <laughs> I was trying to push it down, but push it, dummy. And that's it. Oh. Oh, okay, you break. Um, let's actually be careful and actually carry this. How about we do that? And, oh wait, I see something in there. You have a thing in there. I saw an opal. I kind of want to get that. Yeah, ha ha. Alright. Well, I grabbed it anyways. <laughs> Alright, um, I kind of want to head for this area over here and try to. You know what, I think I will, even though it is actually kind of a dangerous area. It really is, because there is something we have to look out for. And is there... Those are frost pebbles! Um, we haven't seen these, but they're pretty much a smaller version of a frost dallas, if you guys heard about that quest. Alright. Yeah, that just destroyed you. Oh, man, you guys are everywhere! Okay. No. Go away. There we go. Just destroy them. I mean, they do give out some ore, so it's actually not too bad. Some flint. I mean, I don't really need flint because I have a fire weapon. I mean, you might as well get that to the case if you do run out of a flame weapon. Alright, uh... Yeah, you kind of want to be careful in this area because there is a lionel. A, a lionel or two. And I believe they're white main linos. I don't want to face a white main lino because I'm not ready for that yet. Oh, uh, okay. We're heading for another clock around here somewhere. So I just kind of want to be careful because they are out in the middle of the field. So we just got to be careful about that. But if we ever get, you know, spotted by one, I will retreat. Um, what is that? What is that? What is that? That's a Lizophilus, I believe. Yeah, it looks like a Lizophilus, I think. Alright, I'm <laughs> just trying to be careful because this area can be dangerous, so... Just gotta watch out for that. Oh, God. I... No, don't notice me, please. I don't want to be noticed. Don't... Oh, they notice me. Shoot. And I think they have particular kind of arrows. I don't remember. I 
I don't want to be noticed by you guys. Seriously. Ah, you noticed me. Dang it. No. Why did you... Oh, my God. Oh, okay. Uh, um, I got blasted by a fire arrow. Shoot. Um, yeah, let's not eat that. Let's just eat something else. Let's... No, I don't really have anything. I'll just eat that. Be free, my horse. Be free. Actually... Freeze you. Yeah, the ice rod is actually very useful for that, so you can use the ice rod, or blizzard rod for that. Alright. Okay, you're gonna shh. That guy knows me too. You know what? I might as well fight you. Get over here, buddy. I got a tasty bomb for you. No! Go! Oh, God, that was close. Um, no. I need a blizzard rod. No! Gotcha! Haha! -ha. You're not getting on that horse, buddy. I don't know why I twirled there, but whatever. You're going down. You know, since there's a horse here, I might as well use that horse to just travel around. You know what? I'm gonna use you, buddy. I'm gonna use you for a bit, if you don't mind. Alright, let's head for the middle here. Because I kind of want to use this horse for traveling, even though it's very slow. But you know what? I'll work with it. It makes traveling a little bit faster. Since I can't use Wolfling to defend myself. Might as well, you know, use this advantage for a, a horse. And since it's not really running away from me, might as well keep it around. Because I need to get away from a lino, because there is a lino in this area. So, yeah. You know, it would be cool if you could ride on a, on a rhino as well. That would have been awesome. Right, hopefully you stay there. Okay, I need to be careful. There's other horses in that area, too. Uh... I gotta be careful, cause who knows, you might see a lino and I see a sparkly. Give me that sparkly. Oh, it's cool, it looks, makes a little indent on the ground, so it's actually really interesting. Hello. Yahaha. Yeah, ha. Alright, got you out of the way. Now we can head back and go a little bit further. Cause I did see a shrine up ahead. Um, did that horse run off? I hope it didn't, cause I kinda wanna use that horse. Too bad I can't whistle for it. Actually, can I even whistle for it? Because I'm not sure if it will respond to me. Nope, it doesn't. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, hello! Yeah, let's just get away from you. Um, yeah, let's head over this direction. Just gotta keep an eye out for any, um, any lino, because I know there's a lino in this area, so... <laughs> kinda wanna watch out for that. In the meantime, I'm just gonna mash the soothe button. So, oh god, the game is saving. Why is it saving? Oh, you guys. Um, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna bother with them. So, yeah, they can just wander off. Alright. Yeah, I'm just trying to be careful and just take a look at my surroundings here. In the meantime, just use a horse to travel across this area. Alright, so I kind of want to get away as possible from the middle because if you take a good look there might be a line out. Not sure where exactly, but there's enemy fortress. Actually it's actually further ahead. But we're just gonna avoid the middle because that's where the line is gonna be at. I mean it'll be awesome to use the Pona for this area because she has more stamina, but I'll use a horse for the time being. Uh, okay, I just wanna be careful around this area because I don't want to get too close. I don't see it yet. It's probably a little bit further. Alright, I keep soothing you. Okay. Uh, I don't see it yet. Because I know I know for sure there's a lino. Alright. Stop, stop. Oh, I see it. It's way out there. That is a, a white main lino. You, buddy. Uh, you want to mess with me, do you? You want to mess with me? Come here. Come here. Come here, I said. Yeah, melt. Okay, I don't want to whistle just yet because I don't want to get noticed by a line now. And yaha. Yeah. But no, I'm kind of sad that I can't use Wolf Link anymore. I thought he was unlimited, as long as he doesn't die, but I guess I'm wrong on that? That's kind of strange, but whatever. But hey, we're almost to a shrine, so we're almost there. Watch out for that lino over there. I'm gonna avoid that. Actually, there's several linos in the area, not that I realize. Okay, that guy won't notice me. 
I mean, they do have good eyesight, but holy crap. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah, let's go after this one over here first. Okay, avoid you. Okay, and I went out avoid you. Wow. <laughs> I mean, head for this, um, this Korok over here. Alright. Uh, what do we have up here? What do we have? What do we have? Oh, it's this puzzle. Yeah, there's another line off there, too. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. So, just gotta be careful not to get caught. I mean, those guys are not too bad because they have a spear. But still, they're light main line outs and I don't want to mess with them. Maybe if I have more hearts, maybe, but I don't feel confident in facing them right now. <laughs> Like, I'm not too ballsy to just go after stronger enemies. No way. Alright, so. I mean, there's a few stuff over there, so I might be able to head over that area, maybe. But we'll see. Okay, well, at least we have a shrine up ahead, so we can at least head for that one. As long as you don't get noticed by anything. Just gotta keep an eye out for any dangers and, and a lino, especially. So I just kind of get away as further as possible and not get noticed. And along the way get, you know, obviously, uh, shoot, which is, um, got, um, ice was out with, because you're actually going to need them. And I see a wolf, might as well bomb you. Yeah, go away. <laughs> I'm sorry, but go away. No, don't freeze. I need those meat. Hello, buddy. And goodbye. Ooh, you have a weapon. Dragon Ball Moblin Club. Sweet, we got a bunch of these, gosh. Yeah, they got so many of these. I don't really need them, but hey, they're really strong weapons. Right, I think we're in the clear of not getting noticed by a line. Actually, there might be three, because I think there's one down there, too. Man, you guys want to take a fight with me. I mean, I don't mind, but you guys really want to take a fight with me. No! Oh, god dang it, I missed. Uh, come here. Come here! Come on! Get over here! Ouch! Okay, you take some damage. Can you stop running away from me? Can you stop running away? And we have a snow up the rock. I don't want to mess with you. I just want to get inside and leave. Anyways, we have a shrine over here. We have the Shah Gemma Shrine. Get inside before we get pelted by an Octorok. Alright, see you guys inside. Alright, inside the shrine we have Shift and Log. This is actually a fairly easy one, so I don't have to worry about this one. Uh, let me switch my weapon to this. Alright, alright, this one is actually fairly easy. What you need to do really is just use Magnesis and Stasis, so it's actually not too bad. And we got a few treasure chests, so um, let's actually get this one over here first, since it's right in the open. If I don't fall, that is. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, this one's not that simple, or not, well, it is simple, sheesh. Um, it's not that long to do, so I can get this one done in no time. And, you know, have a little bit of spare time to hunt for some more, some more Koroks. Alright, so anyways, uh, let's drop down here. Almost do the same thing again. Alright, there we go. And let's see what we have in here. We have Royal Brawl Sword. Um, yeah, I will trade that in. I don't think I took a picture of that. I don't need the Blizzard Rod, so... I could just trade this... Not that. Trade this in. I need a Frost Spear. Do not get rid of that because the kid wants it. Alright, we got Royal Brawl Sword. Awesome. Actually, did I even take a picture of this? I kind of do want to take a picture of it. I'm going to take a picture just in case. Oh, I'm Evo. Um, yeah, I already did. Okay, so I did use that already. Um, yeah, let's just use this big weapon for now. Alright, is that all the treasure chest? No, there isn't. Okay, there's still a little bit more in this area. Alright, so we need to pick this up. Alright, so let's bring it a little bit high up. Alright, and... Oh! Well, my, my, I kind of feel that. <laughs> let's try that again. Actually, hold on. Wait, I have an idea. Is there like a... Like, yeah, those are those floating platforms. Um, actually, I could just bring this a little bit higher. Okay. Wait. Oh, that works too. That works. 
I mean, you can plate them on top of those pillars, but I'm not really going to. We just need a small key and that's it. And I think that's all the treasure chests, yeah. Yeah, we'll just watch this thing fall. Unless it gets... Nope, it's gonna move. Yep, there you go. Yeah, if that thing lands on your head, and most certainly you're going to die from that. Alright, so open this gate and we get ourselves another monk. Awesome! Alright. So back outside in the blizzard cold, uh, there's a few more crops around here that we can get, so might as well get those before we end the episode. Alright, so um, I know there's like going to be a line on that area, I believe. I don't remember correctly, but if there is, and if we get caught, I'm just simply going to retreat to the nearest uh, shrine and, you know, do something else for the time being. Alright. Uh, let me take care of you. Oh my god. It's, god, it's so many of these things. Ah! You guys are everywhere. Can you come here? I'm gonna run away from you so that we can get closer. Or nah, you can just do that. And you melt. Hehe. <laughs> Alright. Man, I feel like it's a, it's really hard to see in this area now. Like, I feel like I'm having a hard time just trying to see where I'm going. That's so Grab your wings, because I'm going to need them. Alright. Uh, yeah, there is actually a cork right up ahead. But hey, at least we got a shrine out of the way, so that's good enough. Alright, so it's starting to get nighttime here. Which kind of makes it a little bit hard to see in a way, because it is actually getting really dark, so... Can't really see where I'm going. God, I wish I had... The thing that makes you faster for walking on snow, but, well, oh well, can't do anything about it. Just gotta work with it. I mean, it would have been better if I traveled here by horse, but honestly, there's a lot of climbing in this area, so it's kind of not a good idea to do. Alright, um, pop these, and pop that. Simple as that. And yaha -ha. Alrighty. Um, yeah, I believe there is actually a line on this area, but, um, I'm actually, yeah, actually we're gonna head over here, so, yeah, but, um, in the meantime, uh, yeah, actually we're just gonna go head over here, just get this area cleared out, so that way we can work on this area. But, um, anyways, guys, I'll stop here, so next time on The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, um, we're gonna head down that way, try to avoid that line out, and go after those ruins. And also, since it's nighttime, um, I guess we can try to find the style horse, because style horse only appear at nighttime, so we'll do just that. But, anyways, I'll see you guys then. So, this is Chibi Scavenge saying bye!